Hello guys, so this is the Russian Genius and I'm going to be showing you a double lift that is called the Stuart Gordon Double. So this is a very nice double lift. This is a very nice double lift. It took me such a long time to learn. And you know, I learned this double lift two years ago and it's such a nice double lift. Let me show you how it looks like. The double looks like this. That was actually a double lift. So what you're going to do, you're going to get a break below two cards. What you can do, you can pinky count or you can just... You can pinky count the two cards or you can push two cards over. Or if you want, you can riffle and then uh, let two cards go off to your pinky. Just get, a, just get a break below two cards however you want. What I like to do, I like to push it over like this. But, it's, but this pushing motion is very difficult to learn. And I have a tutorial of this where I push the car over on my channel, but we are just going to go into this, alright? So, how you do the double lift, you do it like this. Let me talk about the position, alright? You're holding the card like this. Your ring finger is on the short edge of the deck. Your, your thumb is on the other short edge of the deck. Your middle and first finger, they are on the back side of the card or on the front. These two fingers, they are on this side of the card. And what's going to happen is that these two fingers, they're going to bend the card a little bit. And when they bend it, the thumb is going to slide all the way down to the middle. So the fingers are going to bend the card and the thumb is going to slide all the way down to the middle. So as you can see they bend it and the card slides all the way down to the middle. Just like that. And you know that's that's the double lift. That's it. That's everything you need to know. It's just you you have a break below two cards and then you just then you just take it like this. And you know you're going to you're going to bend the card downwards and then your finger your your thumb is going to come down I just told you guys to take the thumb to the middle, but your thumb needs to go all the way to the bottom, around around to the face of the king. If you're using the king of spades, like I'm using, or a different king, if you're using a picture card, then, then make sure that, that the thumb goes all the way down to the, to the face of the picture card. So that's it, that's the secret. Uh, there are not any more tips I can give you on this, because the rest is just practice. This double lift, it took me two months to learn. It's a very knacky and a difficult double lift. I use this a lot and whenever I use this, is it does not split when I use this. I use this for my ambitious card. When I pick a card, place it in the middle, snap, it jumps to the top, show them the card, place it in the middle. And you know, I can of course show them the card once again if I want to. You know, right there I would use the double lift, and then I can say, look, it's not on top, but if you snap, it jumps to the top. It's it's a great double lift, and that's everything I had to talk about. That was, you just get a pinky break below two cards, and then you just take it like this. And then you just take it with both of your fingers, and then just, you just hold it, and your thumb just slides down. And then you bend the card a little bit. That's it. That, that's, that's the only thing you need to know. That's this. But anyways, thanks for watching and I hope you can try this out. By the way, here's a tip. What you can do once you bend it backwards, once you bend it like this, you can bend it forward again just a little bit. As you can see, I'm bending this backwards and then I'm bending this forwards a little bit. And why I'm bending this backwards and forwards, it's so all the air bubbles, or how they're called, it's so all the air in between the cards, they, they will go away. Because once the air is away, then you can even throw the card to the deck. But anyways, that was, that was it, and thanks for watching. I really hope you enjoy the video, and I just want to thank everyone who has subscribed to my channel, and all that. I really appreciate it a lot. But anyways, thanks a lot for watching, and if you want to join my channel, then click the subscribe button. So thanks for watching, and see you next time.